everyone, it's Dr. Tiana Tyler from Apex Brain Centers. We went ahead and selected a start date for the challenge, which is going to be July 6th, so please feel free to join us. We would love to have you. I'm going to go over a couple of resources before getting started on the challenge that may be beneficial to look over or already have at home. I would recommend going to the Whole30 website. They have an amazing podcast as well as a starter kit that you can sign up for free. They're going to email you a breakdown of the rules which you can uh, leave in your kitchen so that you're always aware of um, following the 30-day plan accordingly. And then you can also receive 15 free recipes which come from her cookbooks. All the cookbooks as well as her additional texts that are beneficial are sold on Amazon and none of them exceed $16 so they're a really great deal. You're going to be using these cookbooks during the challenge but honestly the recipes are so delicious that you're going to use them regardless. Uh, I used the very first book that I used was actually something that I had borrowed and I found it to be extremely helpful because it gave you a breakdown explanation of why you're giving up each item with the scientific backing behind it as well as a breakdown of how you're going to feel each individual day throughout the 30-day span and then it also included how to cook in the first place so if you guys are not familiar with cooking daily in your own home or for yourself it's a really great starter book for anybody new in the kitchen it really is going to give you the confidence that you need to be able to make home cooked meals from then on so that really helped me. Uh, for my second challenge, I actually went ahead and purchased a second book, which is the slow cooker version. So this book is really great for anybody who has an instant pot or a slow cooker and who is a little bit lazy and likes to just have the meals ready within seconds or while you're working doing something else. They also have a fast and easy cookbook that you can purchase on Amazon as well as a friends and family when you're going to be making food for a larger group of people. I recommend you go look at some of these textbooks. They're extremely helpful and the recipes are all delicious. So if you have any other questions for me personally, uh, feel free to reach out and uh, again, please join us on this challenge. It's really going to be beneficial for anybody right now as a lot of us have developed some pretty unhealthy eating. Uh, within the last couple of weeks due to all the stress from what's going on.